Hey everyone, welcome to another Vigaro tutorial. In this video, we will be going over the MySite Web Builder. Building your website with Vigaro creates a unique experience for your customers. With MySite, you can either build your website from scratch or use one of Vigaro's website templates. Little to no web development experience is required. Our web builder is intuitive and user-friendly so that any customer can build their own website. Now, let's get started. Here we are on the marketing menu. To get here, click on the marketing tab on the navigation bar. You can begin by clicking create site. We begin by selecting a style which is the starting point for the design of your website. Each style has different color palettes and fonts. If you hover over the style sheet, you can click on the button to choose it. We get a menu that slides out asking you to select a layout. This will be the structure of your website. If you want to see a preview of it before selecting it, you can hover over it and select Preview. You get a mock web page so you can have an idea of how it looks. We click on Use Website Layout. You immediately get a pre-built website that you can customize even further. Sometimes people just want a simple website. You can make the website live by clicking the Publish button and clicking where it says Publish. Now let's begin adding some custom designs to the web page. Here on the left side of the screen, you can see three icons. One for settings, one for pages, and one for editing. Here, you get a couple of drop-down menus. Clicking on them will expand the available tools. Let's begin with the Vigaro components. The biggest advantage with my site is the Vigaro integration. All the components here are already filled out with data from your Vigaro account. For example, if you wanted customers to book directly from your site, you can click and drag the Book Now module, and it will allow customers to search your services, allowing them to book times that will be synced with your Vigaro calendar. If you're a business that sells a lot of products, you can display them directly on your website so customers can purchase them. You can click and drag the product component, and you will get all your product displayed in real time from your Vigaro account. Now, let's assume your website is published. Click on the Publish button, then click on your website URL. If we click on a product image, you can see the product page that customers can purchase directly on your website. Now, let's get back to the builder. Keep in mind that all Vigaro components must be edited from your Vigaro account. If you hover over Vigaro components, you will see a text saying, Synced with Vigaro which means you will not be able to edit the information or images through the editor. Next, we will be changing our header image. Click on the image on the editor. When you click on any element within the editor, there will be tools on the right-hand side to edit those elements. For this example, let's scroll down until you see background. Click on it, then click on background image. Here, you can upload your own personal images or you can use the online library to search for images using specific keywords. Click on the image you like and click Add Image. Just like that, your image has been updated. Keep in mind that My Site Editor does support redo by holding Control or Command and clicking Z. This will reverse any action you did, making it easier to build your website. If you want to adjust the length or width of any of your components, click on it and click on the circles within the lines. You simply click and drag to fit your desired height or width. Now let's go over the settings menu on the left. Click on the icon and click General. Here you can upload an icon that will appear on the browser tab. Below that is Web Clip Image, which is the image shown on a website link that is saved on an iPhone home screen. Finally, you can add custom Google Analytics ID, header, and footer codes. Make sure to hit save after editing any of these settings. Now let's go to site styling. Here is where you can adjust your design template globally. This means it will affect all components on your website. For example, let's click on colors. On the right side, you can click a color and change to whatever you like. Once you do that, all parts of the website that are linked to that color will have changed. Now, click on the arrow to go back. The last thing to mention about my site is that option to purchase or transfer a personal domain. You can do so by clicking Domain. Here you can click Get a Domain or Use a Domain I Own. 
When you use my site, this is the default domain you will get for free. If you want to purchase one, click on Get a Domain and search for the domain name you want. If the domain isn't available, you will be recommended ones that are similar. Now, if you want to transfer your domain, you would click the other option. Here, you will simply type in your domain name and select which provider it's linked to. Once you select your provider, click Connect Domain. Remember that all domains Vagaro offers uses HTTPS for a secure connection to your website. Finally, a great feature about my site is that the websites are automatically responsive, which means it will be ready for other resolutions, like an iPad and mobile device. You can switch between formats by clicking on these icons at the top, giving you easy visuals and allowing you to customize your website based on screen format. Now, we are all done here. This video was all about getting started with my site. 